And this morning, some South Florida first responders are on their way to Louisiana, ready to help. CBS 4's Francis Wang joins us live from Miami with the details. Francis, good morning. Hey, good morning, Maribel. Yeah, a 45 person team will get there this afternoon before the storm comes in. Their main mission is to help with water rescue after Hurricane Delta passes. Now, this team is the Florida Task Force 2 team. They're from the Urban Search and Rescue Team, and they just received those activation orders last night from FEMA. They only had about four hours to get all they needed and go. Now, right now, with COVID, missions like this are different. As the members of that task force came in, they had to take rapid anti test and a nasal swab test. The team members then pack their communication equipment, swift water gear, heavy rescue equipment, their boats, and in light of the pandemic, their PPE. It, it makes it more difficult, uh, but most of our members are firefighters, so they are on the front lines dealing with COVID every day. So it's not the, it's not uh, a normal for us at this point. It's normal operation, but we will be doing things to make sure that we are properly, uh, uh, sec you know, that we have the proper PPE on and we are uh, following all safety guidelines. And when that team arrives uh, later this afternoon, they will familiar, the, familiarize themselves with the area. They will hunker down until the storm passes and then they'll get to work again. Their main mission is uh, water rescue and they are expecting a lot of water. Live this morning in Miami, I'm Francis Wang, CBS4 This Morning.